Hello, Patrick T here again. Welcome to my channel, guys. If you love anything and everything about perfume, please stay tuned. And, guys, if you are new here, please consider subscribing to my channel. And thank you to all the followers and subscribers for unending support. I was really blown away. I just thought, guys, that I'm just doing this for like. Um, out of curiosity because I have lots of uh, fragrance but I'm enjoying this guys I was enjoying for the haters I was enjoying for the love of the fragrance community today guys another Farfum du Marley house this is a Layton exclusive uh, join me for the presentation Farfum du Marley Layton exclusive the box of the Layton exclusive is different with the the normal Layton. This is the normal Layton, and this is the exclusive box, guys. Front, this is very. It's like a matte finish, blue, metallic blue, and your front the logo, name of the house, Layton exclusive. Edition Royale 125 ml <clears throat> Nothing going on on the left and right about you your bottom same far from the Marley some of your information made in France and your top has this um, Far from the Marley logo bottom some of your ingredients barcode and this is how you open guys boom voila the fragrance is sitting in this velvety in the middle it's very secure guys this is really nice sitting in there very securely and this is your bottle the bottle is same with the Layton you know those dark blue matte finish but but the difference is there is a Layton exclusive on the front. Your front, guys, logo, name of the house, and name of the fragrance, Layton exclusive. Same, nothing going on your left and right, but your bottom, your some of your ingredients, and this is where you find your batch coat. And the cup, as always, guys, very heavy. This one is chrome metallic color and there's a logo on the top your atomizer is chrome and let's check this atomizer as always carpum de marley guys very nice atomizer and that is your Layton exclusive carpum de marley presentation welcome back yes guys is that's just very same they are almost similar guys the, the, to the regular Layton. The, the difference was they have Layton exclusive on the front as is the same. Before guys, all the exclusive line is always come up with the 75 ml, but now they have the just new release, the Layton 125 exclusive. Yeah, I really like it. If you put this in your wardrobe, it's just like if you wanna don't wanna see this. If they can't see this, it's just like a similar to the old Layton. But we are not here, guys. We are jumping into this scent straight away. How does this smell? What is the difference between the old one? And yes, here we are. We break down, guys. Let's break down the notes first. So the top notes. The top notes, guys, are almond, mandarin, orange, and bergamot. The middle notes, uh huh, they say sebat here, geranium, rose, gardenia, and water lily. The base are ganya wood, wood, coffee, vanilla, sandalwood, patchouli, oak moss, pink pepper, and amber. This is the opening, guys. It opens to it opens guys there is this uh, DNA of the old perfume de Marley but there is no apple note 
the minty um it's the dna day was there guys but i could not really smell the apple anymore to my opening is this is a real nice very nice coffee and almond the coffee and almond is there it becomes it becomes gourmand gourmandish coffee vanilla and almond is there and there is a background of animalic civet guys and the wood here is just not really stinging it's just like about very uh, subtle almost not not noticeable anymore but the civet guys is there you know um and the, the fairy is like very animalic in a good way guys because the gourmand and the slash undertone of animalic is there this is like the old the old dna of um layton the animalic sitting there the almond is sitting there and the vanilla your 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 sandalwood um your oak moss and the pepper and the sweetness all over the place but to to my nose guys it's really a layton uh, the dna of layton that that like the sweet the creamy of that vanilla the the you know the patchouli the minty is really there but the add more dark and more animalic and becomes gourmand so the layton the old layton is last almond civet coffee becomes animalic and becomes animalic and a gourmand together in dot dna layton old dna and it's what the verdict to me guys some will like hate this but to my nose guys to my liking this is like a nine 0.5 out of 10 because I like more the old Layton because of that sexiness of the apple this guys becomes dark animalic gourmand but in a good way guys when I say in a good way this is the Asian nose I represent I hope um, the Filipino will watch me now I been I want to be here for the Asians there are a lot of age, uh, Western, you know, um, there are a lot of Western subscriber there. So I'm, I'm, my target is really an Asian because we are in a tropical, but it's not just Western because the Arabs and the Western are patronizing me and love me. So I'm focusing on that really now. So yeah, I wish I've been here, guys. When I say I love it, I love it as an Asian knows. And last is last Western. So this is really a very nice, pleasant. It becomes more um, sophisticated, more rich, more unique because of that civet on the animalic plus the gourmand together. This is more like um, Layton, and you put a billionaire money there, and that's because that's the Layton guys. The Layton becomes sophisticated, unique. Um, um very niche quality that's it guys and you know they take talk out the spiciness the pepper the apple there on the enlightening the gourmand the coffee and the almond and the civet here it's really nice and that's my verdict my verdict is 9.5 out of 10. i like this i really like this as well but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna abandon my latent out of this so if you choose this and this this is not a redundant guys this is not a redundant why because this is too mass appealing uh i'm gonna make another niche really quality that's that the only the only people that love this will love this that's what maybe they're trying to portray here so 9.5 out of 10 with the scent the longevity guys perfect 10 out of 10 who could wear this i see unisex really um who would wear this guys this is a unisex uh, ladies can fold this up this is uh this is a gourmand sweet floral there is an animalic but it's it's not to the extent is it's the civet here it's just um uh back up notes make it become sophisticated and long lasting 
but it's not really uh, a bad and pleasant animalic it's just there to support the notes of the gourmand so yeah ladies can pull this off and in the adults guys i don't know canteens can pull this off if you're bold enough and winter wear is all day and night um very pleasant you can you can rock this up in the office charts and in a meeting and gathering on the total of this guys is 10 out of 10. yes i still rate this a 10 out of 10 layton exclusive a perfect 10 out of 10 i like the smell i like the performance and the uniqueness out of this if you understand why they're why you were trying to make this you will love this and that is me guys patrick t always saying it's not how you look no no it always how you smell god bless guys peace out boom